and moving on to my bedroom you guys the last time i wiped this um portraits i think it was third week of december and the day i decided that you know what um i want those portraits in the bedroom i told myself that i was going to wipe them at least twice or three times a week but in reality it's really not easy it's really not easy but then I went ahead to wipe them but my intention was to just um, wipe the headboard because um, the last time I wiped this headboard I think it was last week and it's hot and most of the times I like to open my bedroom window wide open so that um, the fresh air can come in but whether I like it or not opening the window like that it means the dust will come in Having a small space means that you'll be limited to to buy new furnitures, new items. As for me, um, I believe you know how my living room looked like before and before that again. <laughs> because I think I changed the couches twice, yeah, ever since we moved here. So um what i mean is that having a small space it means you just have to keep everything minimal even right now the project that i have for my living room i'm trying all my best to you know sell things that i know this ones we don't use them that much and they're taking much space so um i think it was last year or the year before last year I wanted to buy a bookshelf in my head i wanted this bookshelf with three layers where i can keep my books because i was reading then and i don't know i think okay i i stopped reading but i'm going to go back to the book shop and buy more books because i really need to finish this uh shomu series so i think when i go there i'll have to buy two but thing is i don't know the guys these books for me they're so expensive but they are worth it because the each book of Lomu, um series it's 300 and what i like about them the um the pages the first book i think it was how many pages four or five hundred pages and then zandile is like 300 pages as for a lady apparently it's um 330 pages so it's it's something that you know for two or three months you are sorted so I think I'll just, I don't think actually, I will, I will, just that I like to read after my birthday. I don't know why I came with that mentality that I only read after my birthday, meaning April, because my birthday is on the 31st of March. But either way, <laughs> that's another story for another day. And um, if you have a small space, just comment down below and let me know how do you maintain it. And one thing about small space is that if you don't tidy it up like same time then just be prepared for a messy living room and more especially the living room um the living room is some space that you always have to tidy up i don't know if it's because i have a toddler in the house or it's the space itself um i can even tidy my actually i tidy my living room three or four times a day but it doesn't mean that i have to mop but sometimes i just take the cushion i put right i take the throw blanket i put it right i remove some things on the floor you oh, guys <laughs> but anyway god will bless us with a bigger space one day that one i believe 
and I went ahead to just clear things up on Abigail's chest of Tora. I'm not gonna say it's Abigail. This one is me and Francis, and from the look of things, it's me. In that red storage box, um, we keep our medicine and our tablets, and those two um, red and orange um, vase vases. I believe you know them if you are regular on my channel. I removed them because um, remember I sold my TV stand and they used to be on the TV stand. I just decided to keep them this side <laughs> for now. I decided to keep them this side for now. And the book that I just showed you guys there, I've been giving that book for the past three years and I'm not done. And it's a small book. I'm not done reading it. I only read it when I feel so bored. Yeah. When I feel so bored because it's not the kind of book that I'll sit down with my coffee and enjoy it. It's really not that my style. Uh, I did not buy it. Um, we were gifted it from my previous um, workplace. So I was just like, okay, it's fine. And then there, guys, I have this mic to do the voiceovers. But to be honest with you, I enjoy doing the voiceovers with my phone. I don't want... To sit down disconnect connect something with just to do the voiceovers so i use this my phone to do the voiceovers but i don't know whenever i have time or whenever i feel like i can use that one i will because i tested it it's working 100 percent <laughs> it's time to prepare the dinner i'm having my frozen spinach there so i normally cut my vegetables and keep them in the refrigerator and then whenever i want to cook them i just take them out and today we'll be eating spinach i'm not gonna make um creamy spinach today i'm just gonna keep it traditional spinach onion fry it and um fish fish hake pap and cream mm -hmm.